Thanks for tuning in to Cupcakes and Coupons. Just wanted to come on real quick with yet another Kroger haul. I, I'm loving Kroger. Cannot stay away. But anyway, um, I am showing some different things this time around. Not trying to show the same things over and over. But I went back this morning and I actually picked up 10 of these toaster strudel, but I've already given five of them away. And they are $2 each. And of course, if you buy five, you get back a $5 Catalina. Well, in my region, we had a 35 cent off of one coupon that tripled to $1.05, making these 95 cents each. That is why I added this yeast um, to kind of um, cover the overage so that I could use two of the $5 Catalinas. Um, this was $1.50, had a coupon for $0.40 cents at double two eighty, making these um, $0.70, cents, something like that. But anyway... Here is my receipt. You can see that 35 cent coupon tripled to a dollar five for all 10 of this toaster strudel and the yeast after my two five dollar Catalinas. I paid 20 cents out of pocket and of course got back ten dollars and Catalinas. Most of the time when I go in, I kind of have everything together. Um, and ev so far, everything has gone smoothly. But um, this time around, I had, and I've shown you guys this before, having a couple of envelopes. And I had my first transaction and second transaction. And I always put an alternate item just in case they don't have this. I can get this. And so on and so forth but yeah and I had all of my coupons for my first transaction in this one and so on and so forth it just makes it so much easier when I'm doing multiple transactions to do it that way okay guys so another transaction which actually happened to me my second transaction I got something that I hadn't gotten um, and I really don't even know why but I hadn't gotten any of these items. I got refried beans, enchilada sauce, and the green chili enchilada sauce, which I've never tried, but perfect time to try it for free. So I got nine of the cans, one thing of taco shells, and I knew I was going to need something else. So again, I added the yeast. I bake a lot of bread. And plus the holidays are coming up, so we'll definitely be baking a lot of bread. Um, here is my receipt for this one. I paid after my the two $5 Catalinas, I paid $0.40 cents and got back two more $5 Catalinas. So in this transaction, I got eight of the potatoes. And um, I got two taco shells to make up my 10 items and to cover the overage um, for the potatoes, I added this on sausage. I added a couple of packages of cornbread. And I decided to add A couple of cans of soup again I have never tried this soup um, so why not try it for pretty much free um, I had a Kroger 
coupon for the sausage that took off 60 cents and I had a coupon for the soup the soup they were a dollar 25 each I had a coupon that took 50 cents off of two which doubled to a dollar um, which made these 75 cents each and the reason why I was showing um, more transactions because it, I know it seems pretty um, repetitive but I was showing some items like if you are using the coupons for the um, potatoes there's pretty much what I would call overage so I wanted to add things that I need um, as well as you know of course if you add things that you have coupons to go with that makes the deal even better so um, yeah that is why I decided to show these here is my receipt So here is my receipt for this transaction after my $5 Catalinas I ended up paying 55 cents and of course I got back two $5 Catalinas all of this 55 cents I'm loving this deal okay just to show you guys some other filler items that I added um, I added these chips because they were 10 for 10, so a dollar each. The hubby loves these, so I decided to add these. Okay, guys, so first of all, look at this. So very excited about this. Um, I got these actually yesterday um, at the same location I went to today, but of course I didn't have any more at this location. Um, so yesterday I ended up getting them from two different locations. They are on ad for a dollar each, 10 for 10, had the 25 cents coupon that tripled to 75 cents, making these 25 cents. While I was each. out at my second location yesterday, I couldn't resist since I was already in the store. Um, my little sis had um, gotten these and I didn't even realize that these were a part of the deal. So, like I say, I couldn't resist getting these. So I went ahead and picked up some of the mac and cheese. Um, so anyway, about today's trip, I walked in with $15 in Catalina's. And I walked out with $20 in Catalina's. And the reason those um, old El Paso coupons that I had shown you guys that I had found at Kroger um, when I was getting a rain check for these, they were at sitting up there at customer service all lonely and wanting me to take them away. Um, when using those coupons, they were for a dollar off of one old El Paso product so what I did was my last transaction I got five old El Paso products I used five of those coupons instead of using the overage to get something else I just paid the dollar 25 out of pocket to get the um, five dollar Catalina so that's how I ended up with an extra one. Gosh, I wish I had more of those coupons because it was an amazing deal. That is about it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. What I think I'll do is, at the end of the video, show you guys some of the items that I picked up with the overage. $20 more, I, I don't know if I'm going back. I, I just have no idea, but the good thing is, like I've already said, that I've given away so much of this. Uh, my mom, um, my nephew, a lady that I work with, she says that she really can't afford groceries. So I'm going to um, take some to her for her and her daughter. This is, um, oh my gosh, so amazing to be able to give this stuff away. The thing that I'm looking forward to keeping for myself, I may give a few away to my mom, but 
These are mine. Mine, all mine. <laughs> okay, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.